dancing around like that. <laughs> okay. Okay, so now we're gonna go to Guy Yovan in the kitchen. Um, which, you know, I don't know if you knew this about Guy, but he loves to cook, he's worked in the restaurant industry, and he's quite well at, with the, you know, fork and everything. Guy? <laughs> Do you hear <laughs> All right, thank you, Debbie. You're so dang sweet. Yeah, I do love the kitchen, and I did work in kitchens for a long, long time. We got a great hour uh, coming up uh, in just a bit, and we're going to start you off with our Dash egg cooker in a sec. But I wanted to remind everybody uh, that uh, April is Customer Appreciation Month, and we're excited here. We've been uh, doing it all month long. HSN Cares is actually giving away a thousand dollars a day, every day, to charities that are nominated by our customers. Uh, today's charity was chosen by Tiffany Hunt, and she now nominated the Wishing Well, which is a nonprofit support agency, and it's focused on the well-being of abused and neglected youth in the foster care system. Tiffany is a foster parent who has benefited from the services that the Wishing Well provides. She says the Wishing Well helps us as foster parents and helps children with a place to shop for items that they can call their own. It's a great cause. She says, I couldn't be the foster parent I am without the support and unconditional love. So congratulations, thanks to Tiffany, and the Wishing Well, we're receiving $1,000 from HSN Cares. If you want more information about it, just go to the HSN Cares page, hsn.com, and you can learn about all the various charities that have been uh, selected this month. All right, good stuff, good stuff. Anyway, again, yeah, my name's Guy. I'm gonna be with you for the next two hours. We have our Today Special coming up at the top of the next hour, which is the Wagner Power uh, Paint Sprayer freaking awesome product. So that's coming up. But first, we're kind of in my wheelhouse here in the kitchen, right? We're going to start you out. What's better in the morning than eggs? Uh, healthy, you get all that protein. But eggs can sometimes be kind of a pain in the neck to cook, right? It's kind of a whole production. You got to get the pans out, put the oil in, the butter. And then you got to figure out how you want to cook them. And then what if you break them? All this different stuff. Well, if you got the Dash egg cooker, it makes your life so easy. <laughs> it's so simple. And you know, I'm not just talking about one or two eggs. You could do, uh, what, seven, eight, nine? whatever you want you can do a dozen a dozen eggs at a time because yes. it has layered egg cooking and what i love too is that it's all self-contained you don't have a bunch of different pans you can make omelets in here you can do poached eggs you can do your hard cooked eggs whatever it is you love you can even use it as a steamer for leftovers it's the most convenient thing we, we half the people that buy this bring it to work because they're like oh my god it's yummy food there's no yes. fuss it's the perfect thing to have um, at work and of course kelly Deedring is here good morning now i will tell you a little bit about miss kelly Deedring, who is I wouldn't say you're a, like a health nut, but you're very concerned with yeah, good health. Sure. And uh, she, uh, she does the uh, runs this little goat yoga program. <laughs> I love the yoga. She loves the yoga. She's a mom. She's all these great, yeah. wonderful things and a great cook. But you don't have a lot of time sure. on your hands to like sit down and make a full breakfast for well, everybody. Well, exactly. And when I was introduced to this product, I was like, an egg cooker? Why do I need that? Because I can do it on my stovetop or I can do it here right. or there. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. It's like a coffee maker. It's like you think, how did I ever live without a without coffee it. machine? Yeah. Now, how did I ever live without my egg cooker. Read the reviews. It's a huge customer pick. Huge. This one does a dozen hard-boiled eggs. It does seven poached eggs. It'll do seven little miniature omelets. So think about it, and we'll just talk about hard-boiled eggs here for a second, and then we'll move uh, to all the different kinds of eggs. But normally, you would have to get out that big pot, right? right. Take it to your sink. Fill it up. Oh, yeah. Get it to the rolling boil, which is, what, 25, yeah, 30 minutes? What, like a gallon of water, yeah. a half gallon of water. It's a lot of water. And then you'd have to dunk in your eggs and just time them, not forget about them. And the time that it takes you to do your eggs the traditional way, you could probably have two batches of a dozen hard-boiled <sighs> eggs. And they're perfect. And they're cooked to perfection. Perfect. They're easier to peel yeah. because of the way that we cook them. So there's your hard-boiled eggs. And this one has that double-decker so that you can do two layers, 12, which is a whole yeah. dozen. You know what I'm doing? You know, it's so funny. I didn't tell you this before because I know we've been running around all day. Mom, you know, we're doing this thing for mom. My brother came into town, so we're going to do an early Easter, and we're going to do it today. Oh, nice. So I'm gonna and you're go, doing your deviled eggs. I'm gonna go get. The, I'm gonna get a honey baked ham. He does the deviled eggs. I love honey baked yep. ham. So I'm gonna go get those. And I am gonna. I'm gonna use my egg cooker today, and yep. I'm gonna do as many eggs as I can because a dozen makes 24 half. Yep. And that, I will oh, tell that's ya, quite a few. You'll have an extra well, extras to bring in for me. I totally will. He's always make, said he's gonna bring me his deviled uh, eggs, and not once has he ever brought me one of his deviled eggs. I, I, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna bring you a deviled egg because they're just so one. freaking just, good. But I'm anyway, just asking for one. That's all. It makes life so much easier, and I don't have to worry about setting timers and all stuff because you put when you put the water in. There's a measurement on the little cup that yep. tells you exactly how much water to put in. When it boils away, it turns the machine off and your eggs are cooked perfectly. That's if you like them well, well cooked. That's that the hard-cooked eggs. Right. Are you going to do eggs like this, Guy? 
Oh my gosh! Look, look at, at these. Look at her little Easter eggs. Okay, this will arrive to you in time did, for did, Easter. Did Amanda yes, that? Amanda did these. Adorable. They're little chickens. They're so cute. But, I mean, that's for Easter, and you will get this in time. So yeah. if maybe you are the mom, the grandma, the aunt, the uncle, the grandpa that does all you know the hard cooked eggs for Easter in terms of like dyeing them. Yeah. This you have got to have for yeah. hard boiled eggs. I'm gonna I'm gonna show everybody what they get really okay. quick, Kelly, and then we'll and then do hard boiled. And then we're just gonna go the whole way through. Let's we're do gonna it. show you because we've okay. made so many different types of eggs so everybody the order gets the egg cooker and you'll notice that it's a uh, double layer now you don't have to use both layers if you don't want to if you're just doing like six or seven eggs sure. whatever you, you can do, do anywhere it. from you one to like a dozen that. but yep. i love that you have another layer and uh what you do is you pour the water in the bottom okay the bottom water goes underneath i don't want to take the whole thing apart but it goes underneath and this is a little measuring cup that tells you how much water to put in based on the number of eggs and the, and the way you want them cooked in addition to that you're going to get the three egg little poaching tray. So if you like uh, like, an, uh, like a soft cooked egg on an English muffin, oh yeah, oh yeah, that's it. If you want to do more, there's the do four. seven at a time. You can do the four eggs. Now you can stack these and do seven all together. Yep. This is a little omelet tray, right? Or, or a leftover tray. Like if you want to heat up, reheat like fried rice or something, you can fill that up and put that in there. But this is for making omelets. That's included. There's an egg cooker uh, guide in here, a quick start guide that gives you all the information that you need. Um, and there's uh, actually a little, um, like almost like a little cookbook Book, recipe book in here and, and idea that book. has the time and also it has the water measurements yes so what's great though is that you don't necessarily need to look no. at that this has the water measurements on it so for example if I'm doing hard cooked eggs all I do is I take my water any water just from the tap and fill it up to the line that says hard perfect if you're doing soft cooked eggs it says soft if you want to do like middle of the road sort of poached but a little harder on the exterior you would do medium so you fill it right up to that line and then you take it right to the burner which is just the bottom piece here and you're getting all the pieces there's no accessories that you have to purchase extra and you're just going to pour it right over your burner now what's so neat about dash is they've thought of everything so there's a little pin underneath here yeah let's let's a close up of it because we never do that you see that little pin what does that do so that thank you for asking yeah <laughs> God. That punctures. You puncture Why each do we want to do that, Kelly? Thank you again for asking. You Teed just it up for you. Go ahead, go ahead. You are on fire this morning. You just put a little <laughs> hole in each egg, and we've already pre-punctured these, but what this does is as it steams and as it hard cooks, it separates the hard cooked egg from the shell. So right. that's why they're easier to peel. Easier to peel. So there is some yep. science behind it, which is really great because many of us struggle with the 800 million billion, t you know, trillion little pieces. <sighs> or the skin sticks to the inside. Or the skin sticks and to, and, and you get miserable. these ugly eggs yep. and then you have to throw them away because you're not going to serve an ugly deviled egg. I doubt Guy would even no, serve, you no. wouldn't serve an ugly I just, deviled I, egg. I wind up giving the white part to Danny because he likes, uh, he'll eat that. And or then the dog. I, and I put the yolk back in and I just oh, add yeah, the yolk for, yeah, for, for the, extra yolk. Sure. But I hate, it's just very, We give very them to the dog. And even by the t by Good the end form. of the day, the dog is sick of the eggs, yeah, unless yeah. you're doing it with the Dash egg cooker because it peels easily. Yeah. So you can do anywhere from one to a dozen. You don't always have to do a dozen, but I love the fact that I can do the whole carton if I want you to. You should do, I, I like to do a lot every time just because I think it's it's a smart way to do it. Plus, is there anything better when you're hungry to pop an egg in? Like and, a, uh, and they last for ages. They, I mean, you're talking weeks, you could probably still... Like the perfect food. Yeah, they're, so seven grams of protein. Yeah. 70 calories on average for a large egg and about seven cents across the country, depends on where you live, per egg. I, I love Seven things, cents yeah. for seven grams of protein. I, I love That's things. a penny a gram of protein. Yeah, like like perfect foods like yeah. eggs, which is relatively shelf stable too. I know in the restaurant business, you, know, you could leave your eggs out for, for a day's cooking. Yeah, room temp. Yep. They don't, nothing happens to them because you know, they have, they, you know, they, they, these are, we're living things. You yep. know, they have their own natural defenses in, in there and they're so dang good and delicious. So so at the end of the day, we're gonna we're gonna so you, cook these. Yeah, you just you just hit the little on switch, yeah. and then when this is done cooking, it will buzz. So you don't even so have to smart. guess. Like you might be getting your eyeliner on, or brushing your teeth, or <sighs> you know catching up on emails yeah. in the morning, and this will buzz, and you go, oh, I just cooked a heart, you know, a dozen eggs. I yeah. didn't have to worry about the ro rollover, the rolling None boil. Of that. Yep. So what did we do here? So we did seven poached eggs in seven minutes. Wow. Have you ever done one poached egg in seven minutes? And not break it, or not or break muck it, it or have or the you know the vinegar yeah. and all that so we're gonna set that down and then right here we've got four going on underneath so you don't again have to do seven poached eggs although that'll feed two people right yeah. two maybe three but people. if you're an empty nester and you want to put one tray in for for two or three or four it's perfect and I will tell you they wind up being perfectly cooked every look at look at how beautiful so it's oh, that hard cooked exterior my, my producer our producer Jared is yes. he's, he's had a long day today I bet he'd like a nice poached egg look at how beautiful oh. so do you ever go to the brunch restaurants and you always order the eggs Benedict 
Wow. And because you don't want to do your own poached <laughs> eggs, look at those poached eggs. Wow. And you can do seven of those if you want. Like if you're serving a brunch, maybe you're hosting a shower, a, a wedding shower, a bridal shower, baby shower, anything like that. Imagine that. serving poached eggs. Look at, look at, look at. I mean, nobody's doing it, that anymore it. because it's such there a. There it is, <laughs> Kelly. Look. <laughs> Yummy. That's Look a sexy that. egg right Isn't there. Isn't that beautiful? All right, let me let me tell everybody quickly too. We yes. have colors available. Everybody is ordering black. I have more than just the black color. My favorite is that aqua turquoisey color over there. It comes in what we call grape, which yeah, is that's the purple. Yeah, that's pretty too. And then it also comes in red. So, um, and it's so simple to use. You know, a lot of people are afraid to cook eggs because they're afraid they're going to screw it up. No, 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 not um, with which, red which I will tell you, in a fry pan is you probably have good reason. It's it's, it's a pretty delicate process. You know, we have to use nonstick pans or pour you know half a cup of butter in a pan if it's a stainless pan because because we don't want it to stick. Um, what I recommend with these two, and I do it with mine, um, when you use it, I spray mine with just a little sp a spray. You can, you can. Um, you don't have to. Yeah. I like to do it because I, I I think they just pop out a lot easier. Yep. Um, and it, you know, it's nothing. Or you could just, you, if, if you don't want to use that, take a little vegetable oil and on a paper towel and just rub it in it. And then you really don't have to do that again. It almost fuses with the pan. It's, it's like when you season a pan. Yeah, sure. And they're perfect. And you don't always have to do the same kinds of eggs. So here's something that's really cool. What'd you do? I just cracked my eggs directly into my poaching tray. So that's going to be four poached eggs. And then on the top, that's going to be four soft boiled eggs. If you like soft boiled eggs with little toast points or something um, like yeah. that. Who doesn't love that? I mean, you can do two different kinds and then it, tr you thinking about the technology, it's a steamer. Yeah. So look what we were able to do. We did this our is breakfast. when I was talking about bringing it to work. Yeah, breakfast right? potatoes. Look at that. Oh. So, yeah, you can bring it to work with you because it's a nice small footprint. Think of it as like a little miniature steamer. I like it so much better than the microwave to reheat things, too. Like oh, if yeah. you have like, oh, say yeah. you have like day old Chinese food or something like that or, or like egg rolls or something and you want to kind of put life into them, use these trays and just pop it on with a little water. I mean, look at that omelet. Oh, my God. And those breakfast potatoes. So, you know, don't just no. use it for hard boiled eggs. Okay. I mean, you're going to love it for hard boiled eggs, but think about all the different uses for it. And look at how perfectly And cooked. that's a four-egg omelet. You know, if you were going to do a four-egg omelet on the stovetop, you'd be babysitting it for 10 minutes, wouldn't you? It's perfect. Yeah, it's, it's perfect. It's perfectly I'm cooked. Taste it. It's light, it's fluffy, it's cooked with steam, which is the healthiest way to cook. Delicious. Isn't that beautiful? Mm, yeah. All right, I like this example, too, because no eggs in this one, and that's kind of where you were alluding to. Mm -hmm. We did our steamed rice. So you just yeah. put your white rice, your brown rice, your wild rice, your quinoa, whatever you want in the bottom. Yeah. This took about 15 minutes to steam. Oh, and look at how her and I love, man, that's, that's, what's that, basmati? I love basmati Okay, rice. and then look, we did our vegetables at the top, like a stir-fry vegetable. You. And you can season them how you like, you know, just a little salt and pepper, you can put a little seasoning. You can make them low calorie. Sure. Like, look, and we just look steamed the this beautiful shrimp. I mean, this is what we're talking about. You can utilize this for more than just eggs. Although I'll say 90% of the time, don't you think you'll use it for eggs? But at the end of the day, if it's sitting at your desk and you want to steam a beautiful meal, you don't have to go with fast mm. food. You don't have to do the microwave. I mean, right eggs. there. I love eggs. I do too. They're a perfect food. They're seven so grams satisfying. of protein. They keep you full. They're a bit, they're a bit of a, a pain to cook normally, but this well, is so easy. Well, because the frying pan and the splatter right. and the mess, yeah. Jared is rushing us along. Oh, is he? Yeah. He's, he's Maybe we should feed him some eggs and then we'll keep him busy. <laughs> All right. If you'd like to get it, it's a customer pick. By the way, I don't think I, I, Kelly talked about it. Almost a thousand five star yeah, reviews. Yeah, people love so, eggs. You're gonna love it. All right, if you want it, it's $24.99 on price break. Um, hey, you know what we're doing? Uh, to celebrate customer appreciation, we are giving away $25,000. That's $25,000 in our sweepstakes giveaway. Um, as I said, it is customer appreciation month, so if you want to get uh, into it, well, you got to be in it to win it, as they say. So if you want a chance to win, uh, you simply go to hsn.com and you look for the sweepstakes thing and you click on that and you can enter every single day through April 30th. So a lot of people are like, oh, can I enter once or can I enter? You can enter every dang day. I don't care. Uh, and I hope you win. Uh, if you want more information, uh, like I said, go to hsn.com and look for that customer appreciation tab. But it's one of the ways that we are saying thank you to our incredible customers out there for all their loyal uh, uh, watching and viewership of HSN and our new customers as well. Okay. Let's move along here and let's talk about, well, we got Kelly here. Let's talk about one of the biggest pain in the necks about, uh, about cooking uh, is the food preparation, right? The chopping and the slicing and the whipping and the blending and all that stuff. Well, this is a huge customer pick and it comes to us from Dash. And I love Dash. This company is great. They create these amazing high-end products without breaking the bank on you. This one today, Jared, does that say, uh, was it 50 and it's down to $29? 
All right, so that is a huge price break. If you want to pick it up today and you're looking for a very convenient, very compact, even portable little food processor, uh, that's what this is going to do for you. As I said, you can chop, you can mix, you can blend, you can whip, and you can do it all in one. Look at the adorable little footprint I on it. I love the size and of this. I live, now you know, I live, me and my son, yep. Danny, live together. Yep. I don't need a big giant food processor. I need something that I can do quick fixes. Most of us don't. Most of us don't. I mean, the average sized food processor is 11 cups. Right. What in the world are you processing <laughs> that yeah. you need 11 yeah. cups of chopped carrots mm -hmm. or celery? So Dash decided, let's make it easier. Let's give it a smaller footprint. It's a two cup food processor, but it's also going to be your chopper. And you're actually going to be able to process food. For example, I'm gonna do salsa. I'm gonna be able to do cashew or almond butter, peanut butter. But I wanna show you just because it's small doesn't mean it's not mighty. Right. <laughs> because you can see all the different prep work we've done here, whether you're doing cauliflower rice, or you want to make cauliflower crust pizza, right, yeah. or you're doing like your mirepoise to prepare, you know, prepare soup for the week or whatever it is. Um, you can see our onions never have to touch an onion again, which no, I think and look at you this. would never get the dice with a knife. I mean, you, you might if you're like a chef, yeah, and but you, most of us yeah, don't have knife skills like even that. Even chefs have a hard time getting that consistency and you need, really need a little machine. So take a look at what, now you've got carrots inside here. Yeah, so here. these are baby carrots. Yeah. It just could be chopped in half. Um, you have two features. It's a pulse feature and a chop feature. So I always like to hit that pulse feature to get things going, but then if I really want to go for it and process, check that out. Oh my gosh. What was that, about eight to 10 seconds? <sighs> and then maybe that's my onion, you know maybe that's my garlic. That would take me 10, 15 minutes, and I'm really good with a knife. To uh, chop and your it hands like that. would hurt, and you'd need a really yeah. expensive knife. Look inside. So look inside, and you can see, and then I'll just pop it off. And then, look you know, obviously that. the blade just pulls out, but look at my chopped carrots, I'm or whatever. Maybe it's out. red onion, and you don't want to touch the onion. Look at it. Maybe it's fresh mint's garlic. Oh, yeah. I, I mean, mean, you don't have perfect. to buy the garlic in the mystery liquid anymore. No, no, which no. Which kills me, because I'm like, oh, just buy the garlic. I, and then chop it yourself. It's so much better. You get so much better flavor. It is so much, and it's better for you. It's not. It's not overly processed. It's not sitting in there and waiting. And plus, the stuff that's in jars. Who knows how long it's been sitting there? Look at the perfect consistency. And notice, and I'm glad you did that live for everybody. You know, these were not. These are not staged. We use the machine. Oh yeah, we have to use these. the machine. Yeah. Absolutely. So yep. you're gonna love it for your prep work. But to me, the most important thing about this is a. Obviously, it's a great price. Yeah. Food processor is about a hundred dollars. It's the lowest price we've ever yeah. done on this machine. And if you've always wanted one and you and like maybe you're an empty nester and you don't need a big giant food processor this is for you now a lot of people wonder if it has the power to do things like make nut butters. Yes. So, it, so it I'm gonna get does. this going and then watch as I pour into the top and I'm telling you this now, but you know, before it's running so that I can just show you while it's running. When you pour into the top, it'll actually fold in things like cream, water, lemon juice, or oil because there's these tiny little holes. So I'm gonna get this going, ready? I'm gonna go ahead and hit chop. And then when you see me folding it in, It'll drizzle it in nice and slow. I've never seen a feature like that on a food processor. Oh, it's got, yeah, the, the little opening is small, so it it's just It's a small in. little opening, so it'll trickle in. It's great if you're in. making mayonnaise or if you're sure. making a Bernays or a hollandaise sauce. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh, you, you are making, what kind of butter did this you make? This is cashew butter. Is there anything better on the planet than cat? Uh, almond I, butter. Is that I like I like cashew okay, butter. Okay, well, it depends on I, your I, taste I, buds. Can you make macadamia butter? You can make macadamia butter. I, you can make peanut just, butter. Homemade Man, peanut butter. I use that as a lotion. If you're super rich, you can make macadamia <laughs> nut yeah, butter because expensive. they're like so expensive. 25 bucks a pound. Yeah, they're expensive. All right, expensive. so look at what we made All in All right, here. so creamy, oh my the gosh. most perfect consistency, and maybe you just like homemade peanut butter over, you know, the jarred peanut butter because the jarred yeah. peanut butter has a ton of sodium. Mm -hmm. It has a ton of added things that you don't know what it is. If you've never had a fresh homemade nut butter, I will tell you it's the greatest thing ever. And you know, there are companies that are making a fortune uh, in the peanut butter aisle by putting this stuff out. Oh, sure. What I like about when you make it fresh too is you don't have to remix it. The oil doesn't separate. It's all emulsified. Look how beautiful so, that is. Try that. Uh, yeah, you don't have to. Ask and me you can twice. actually use any of your favorite, you know, fats, like any oils that you would like to do, right? You don't, oh you don't have to goodness. use the kind. You're not stuck with the kind that the manufacturer is giving you. Oh my God. <laughs> is it good? I'd like to slather it all over. I know. It's so good. Like it's so good it for you. Dash's that motto, is, to be reminded, is, so is it unprocess your food. So. If you go to the aisle and look at the peanut butter, it has yeah, sodium. Yeah, I double dip. <laughs> You've got a problem with that. 
I just, my butt butter, I, I can double dip. I lose all control And you know what's nice, here. too? You could, tri you could drizzle a little honey in there, too, if you want to sweeten it up. <laughs> I mean, it's so amazing. You go behind me this way. Yeah, you could do a little honey or some cinnamon, oh, right? Yeah. Some cinnamon would be nice. But that is so good. To me, it's the footprint. It's all about not having to get out this big, huge 30-pound machine, right? Right. Just to do, because that's what the, the barrier is. It's like, oh, I'm not getting out my giant food processor. A, I've got to lug it from mm. underneath the countertop, and B, I've got to clean that thing, right? Oh, my gosh. All the parts of this, except for the motor, are dishwasher safe. Is it good? It's really, you know what I, you know what kills me too is you did that so quickly. Yeah. You just get your fresh nuts and you put, and you know like, like even like our Publix, which is our big chain around here, yep. they're now selling fresh nuts in the, in the store. Oh, so yeah. you can do it yourself and you do it for a fraction of the for price. For a fraction guys. of the price. Yeah. What are you so making? I can, pesto. So you can see I'm just folding in a little bit more oil. But if you love pesto like I do, but you just don't want to buy the jars. Right. And you see how it's shaking around a little? There's suction feet on the bottom. So it's not going to go dancing. It's supposed to do that. Don't worry about it. It's supposed to do that. That's power, right? Yeah. That's our power. Even though it's a two-cup food processor, it has the power that you need. I mean, unless you're like preparing a meal for 25, 35 well, yeah. people. And, and we, have, we actually have the, 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 um, the Smeg machine coming oh, yeah. up a little bit there later. And I will tell you, that thing, oh my gosh. If you, you know, and I would get both. I would have one for when I'm doing the big industrial sure. uh, meals or if I'm doing uh, baking and I'm doing bread doughs. This is just a little convenient one to have on your day-to-day -day process. Look at what you just made. I right mean, there. there's nothing it, better it, than fresh pesto. Spinach pesto, arugula pesto, whatever you want to use, and then some pine nuts, some Parmesan cheese, a little salt, little pepper, your favorite fat, like Can oil. I smell it? Yes. I'm not going to eat it because I don't want to have this garlic is basil. breath this early, but A little bit of garlic. Smells, this is basil pesto, but you can do like so a good. pea pesto. I mean, if you don't like basil, you can make these I beautiful... I thought about a pea pesto. Oh, pea pestos are really nice because some people don't like pesto. basil. It's a pe it's pe pe pea pesto. All right, just keep going. All right, what else are you gonna make? Are you gonna, help now look, here. fresh blueberries are frozen. It doesn't matter, you can use either. These are frozen. Are you making an ice cream? Yeah, we're gonna do a sorbet. So this is a little lemon juice and a little bit of cream. Or you could do like half and half, or you could do soy milk. Or... I have to remind everybody quickly, this is almost half price. It was 50, it's 29 if you want it today. And it's from Dash. This is a high-end company uh, that specializes in making wonderful products for you. Look at how simple and easy. And I love that you just turn the crank, right? all you do it and, and uh, you can off. leave it on full yep. time and now we're adding a little bit of you can add a little milk or cream or whatever it is whatever liquid you want to sure. add into the top and this you one takes a little bit longer but it doesn't want. matter that's yep. good look see how it's trickling in i don't know if you can see that no it's hard to see on camera but you can see if you want to just trickle it in that's and then really it's good actually feature. creating a vortex inside there and it's pulling everything into the blade creating a creamy from frozen blueberries. It looks like it's getting hard already in there. Isn't that beautiful? Oh and this God. is what we're talking about. This is not just a chopper. It is a food processor, wouldn't you say? And if you see from the above, it's it's what it's doing is it's incorporating. You it's can the actually power. see it. Yeah, so the we're vortex. taking our time. And then you can decide how chopped up you want the berries. There we go. But, but And I'm glad we waited for that. Are you ready? Now, I think yeah, it's ready. I think you're, you're there. All right, so that one may be 35 seconds oh as opposed God. to 10 look seconds. At, look at what's inside there. But now you have a guilt-free dessert, which is frozen blueberries, a little bit of cream, a little bit of lemon juice for kick. You don't have to do the lemon juice, but it has a consistency oh of like God. a soft serve. And actually, I'm going to pull out the blade oh, so that I really can get good. in there. And then look at that beautiful sorbet. Blueberries, a little bit of cream, but it could be soy milk or almond milk. I like using coconut milk, you know, because it has that nice yeah, full so fat and flavor. And coconut, yes, yeah, so that's exactly right. It's yep. very creamy. Look at that. And that's what you did with your little two cups. And then guess what? Portion control, portion control, portion control. Because now you're not going to eat 11 cups of it. Now you've just got those two cups. And if you want to go ahead and freeze it, you certainly could. Look at those desserts. I mean, look, you go to How a restaurant, beautiful. you get those. Look at those, you plating like, those. Well... I know, Amanda's staring at me over there, and if I don't do the right, she, she you know, all the very little touches. Presentation. All right, black is, is hey, by the way, colors, <laughs> it comes in uh, stainless, it comes in red, it comes in aqua, um, black, the black stainless, and then red. So while you were rattling on about colors, yeah. I just made a fresh salsa with five ingredients. So just tomato, you she said rattling on. I was kidding. Hearing? It's okay. No, I have a tendency to rattle. <laughs> All right, look at this. Look at, look at, Fresh look at. salsa. So do me a favor. The next time you go to the grocery store, turn around the jar of salsa, or maybe it's in your pantry right now. 
added sodium. Sometimes it has added food it's coloring, like, like red dye this or that. Tomatoes are red, why are we dyeing our tomatoes, right? Oh my gosh. So now That's... you can do fresh homemade salsa in about 10 seconds. All right. Pop it in your processor and go. You've got less, I want you to do the egg salad because oh, I you think do? this is one of the, yeah, we need to do egg salad you... and hummus really quick. Oh, you have okay. one minute. No pressure. <laughs> hey, get it while it's almost half price, guys. I'm telling you, you're gonna love this thing. And if you love, like me, you love egg salad, yep. you like, even if you're doing your deviled egg mix, now once in a while you may have to just sort of move it around. Well, I'm just grabbing this, look but, at this. No, grab what you got done there. Look at how beautiful that is. I mean, honestly, you know, some gherkins, your favorite eggs, a little oh. mustard, a little mayo, Can a little salt it? and pepper, a little jalapeno if you're me, because I like a little kick. And you have a protein rich, <laughs> so healthy good. egg salad. And then if you make extra, yes, you can freeze it. You know, free, egg salad freezes nicely. Yeah, it really, this is so good. Isn't that delicious? Yeah, and you're right. I like I like a little bit of sweet pickle in mine sweet too. Sweet pickle so. or jalapeno. Okay. I like I'm to do a little jalapeno. Jared's gonna start yelling at us, our producer, to move. So. I know, I've heard Jared's in a quite a mood today, so. He's just had a long day. <laughs> but he's good, he's good to go. You good to go up there, Jared? Yeah, he's good. All right, so now what, we, what do we put in there, chickpeas? Uh, chickpeas, you can do a little tahini. God. All right, so a little bit of oil drizzling in. Notice how it's moving around, but it's suction cup to the top of my counter. That's why they put the suction yeah, cup. Yeah, so it's not gonna dance. Well, because it's got more power than the size of the machine. Yeah, isn't that amazing though? Two cup chopper, and you're not having to get out that big giant food processor. So I really, to me, it's about the power, it's about the size, it's about the convenience, and the ability really to unprocess your food. Get all the garbage out of your food and start creating these beautiful homemade meals because you can't, because you didn't need to take out a big Big clunky machine. Isn't that All beautiful? Right. I will tell you, and I know we are out of time, but I will tell you also, if you've ever made your own hummus, it's so good. My mom it's delicious. made it 40, 50 years ago. When it's we only were a handful kids. of ingredients. It's good for you too. Yeah, it's and so you delicious. could do like roasted red yeah. pepper hummus. Yummy. You could do garlic hummus. You can do all you the things you can hummus. buy in the store, but you can do it fresh. Yeah. Try it, you'll have fun. And you'll like this machine. It's not a lot of work, it's easy. Yep. Thank you, Miss Kelly. I'll Dean. save you some food. Ah, it's fantastic. Hey, egg salad, I'll um, you. Coming up in a little bit, we were talking about our mixer, our smeg mixer, and I will tell you. This, this thing is amazing, okay? I know you, a lot of you know the very famous mixer out there. Well, this has about twice the power, but it is gorgeous. I mean, it is, it's got this retro cool look. Um, it is all um, beautiful aluminum and stainless uh, in its design. It's got that look of the 50s and 60s, but it's gorgeous. It's so much more powerful. They gave us a discount on it today. It is only $319.99. If you are somebody who loves to prepare meals, somebody that's a baker, likes to do bread doughs, all those different things, um, this is a great machine for you. Um, it is an award-winning machine, and I, I, I think it's the most powerful stand mixer that's available out there in the market for home use. It's, it's amazing, but it's not just about power. It's gorgeous, too, and I have it in a variety of colors. That's coming up uh, as our this day only uh, in just a bit. So anyway, you all know my friend Michael Simon, uh, our chef who has joined uh, the HSN family. Well, we're celebrating Michael's anniversary with us. We're so excited for him to be here. And his lovely wife, Liz, will be here as well. I would love it if you would join me Friday morning at 8 a.m. Eastern time. The three of us will be here. She's there with Marlo, and Marlo's uh, got this cool new cooking show. But anyway, Michael's gonna be here, and that starts this Friday. So if you wanna see him and his beautiful wife, Liz, they're gonna be cooking all kinds of great stuff. Uh, so we're excited about that. All right, my friend John Florell joins me. And John and I, you know, John and I are kinda like outdoor guys. We like yep. to cook and fish and do all these different things. We like to get fresh food. We like to cook it. But when we get back to the at the end of the day, we're, we're just like everybody else. We don't want to make a big mess. We right. like having everything in one oh, pot. It makes it so much easier. This company is called Starfrit. Now, I yep. got a, uh, two pieces of their cookware about two years ago. Uh -huh. I will tell you, nothing can hurt these pans. No, I know. It's... They are the most amazing, indestructible, nonstick pans mm -hmm. I've ever owned of any of the cookware that I've gotten at HSN. I love Starfruit. I keep asking the buyers, I'm like, buy more of these pans. They're unbelievable. <laughs> they are. A very unique way they're designed. But, and John will get into all that, but this is called the Rock 4.5 liter electric multi-pot. I was so excited when this came out because they were just doing regular cookware here. If you want to get the most delicious, nutritious, amazing food and have it all cooked in one easy to cook in, easy to clean pot, this does it. I, this stuff totally rocks. It is self-contained. You can steam, saute, boil, stir fry, so much more on hsn.com, four and a half star customer pick. And it has this crazy, what they call rock technology, nonstick on the inside. So you're never gonna have to muss and fuss with this thing to try to clean it. 
Uh, I say I, it uh, saves energy because you're not uh, heating up the whole house. You could do chickens in here. We did it. Look, John just did a whole chicken soup. It's an entire chicken soup. Wow. And literally, it's done in, in, the, in a lot less time. And again, you mentioned it, a lot less cleanup. Yes, because yes. Because it's all done in one pot. And with that nonstick coating, you can literally use this for every every, every dish you want to cook in. Anything. I mean, I you, mean don't, you won't even use your stove top and, anymore. Mac and cheese oh, yeah. for the kids. You can do and, mac and cheese in here. <laughs> yep. No kidding. And I mean, you can see how we, this is an entire chicken, okay? The capacity of this pot is amazing, but it's such a small footprint on your countertop. But you can see, I mean, look at this. That's just like fall off the bone, juicy, delicious, it's succulent chicken. That is, I mean, it, fresh, right? Yeah. I mean, every, all these vegetables cook perfectly. And again, the, what I love about it too though, guy, is it's it, not only the, the versatility, but it's also, uh, let, me, let me put it this way. When you want it hot, it's hot almost instantly. Yeah. When you want to cool it down, it cools down almost instantly because of the technology that goes into this pan or this pot. One pot does it all, okay? The lid has a, it's a perfectly formed lid. Yeah. It's got the uh, the steam hole in the top, so it relieves the pressure. No okay? boil over. And you can set that, no boil over. You don't have to worry about it. But the control, this is what I like to show everybody. And I don't know, it, we've got them in the back here. Actually, you just turned that I, off. You know what you I did? You messed up my demo. No, you know what I wanted yeah. to do? Because I, because I know we don't have a lot of time here's in this the show. Thing. This I, thing was not. I just wanted to show you. Yeah, there was nothing going no, on in here. it was all the way down to 200. Well, watch, we'll do it again. Yeah. yeah. And just to show you how fast it heats up. I mean, watch this. I'm going to turn this up to 350. And right here on the side Let's is your watch. dial. It goes all the way up to 400. But watch how fast how the reaction time that this gives here you is amazing. So it went from simmer or from almost warm all the way up to a full steaming boil okay. in less than 30 I've seconds. I've never seen a pan okay? that quick. And it's that quick and easy. Now, you can add all the other ingredients in there. We have already browned the, uh, the, the, uh, the beef here and we're gonna make a quick chili. So we'll pour in our onions, we'll set the top, the, the uh, lid on top, we'll let those uh, onions uh, uh, glaze up a little bit. But it, it's such a versatile pot. Like I said, you can even use it as a wok, okay? And as a wok alone, I think, I mean, for an electric wok, yeah. <laughs> if that's all you use it for, it's... for stir fries, it heats up instantly. We've got this one turned up to about 375, but you'll see how, with that rock surface, by the way, you'll notice, Oh, you can't I, hurt it. I, you, you cannot never... hurt the surface. <laughs> it's metal utensil safe, warranted for 10 full years. 10 years. Yeah. That's unheard of. But that's also why, I mean, with, with our raw cookware, people love them because you really can't hurt them. There's, you, it's pretty much goof-proof cooking. It, it, to me, you know, the saute pans, I still have them. And, and let's talk about what's in there too, John, because it's yeah. a special nonstick surface that's it is. actually created, right? The reason that it's so nonstick stick is the is the technology that goes in this involved what we do is as the pan is forming we shoot these little BBs which create divots in the bottom of the pan and then our coating goes over the top of that so that what it does is it creates air pockets underneath which gives you true non-stick without all those you know the, the chemicals involved right. okay no, no, no sprays or anything exactly like that. so and that's again why we call it the rock because literally I mean it's like cooking in a rock you can you use any purchase. utensils and, and the shape of it and the size of it is perfect this is really deep we can cook for six or eight people inside oh, yeah. here or just well, for two this stir Look fry at how fast your I shrimp mean, that quick and easy your shrimp is pretty much done you can add your veg to it we're gonna throw some scallions in there we'll throw some uh, some peppers in there you can snap peas green oh, peas yeah. whatever you like okay to add to your stir fry here let's put that all in there because I, I just yeah, love and it and then let's right? let it do its and, business yeah and now because it's so non-stick okay we can do our sauces right over the top. And we'll put the lid on, we'll stir that up here in a minute, but you don't have to worry about the cleanup because it wipes out almost like, <laughs> like instantly, now, okay? We, yeah, we give it a stir. Now watch, we're gonna let this cook for a couple of minutes, yep. and when we come back, wait till you see how beautifully cooked this is. I mean, it's it, essentially, you can never cook uh, like like they do in the restaurants at home because you don't have the blowtorch burner. Right, right. But what you need is you what need a pan does, that gets hot enough to sear the food, and that's what again, this does. That's, again, right here, this is what's so great about this unit is the instant control, okay? It goes from warm, so you can take this to, you, you can use it as a warmer, okay? Oh, yeah. If you wanna keep your chili warm, if you wanna keep your, whatever it is, like we'll go back to our chili here in a second, but 
as soon as you turn that up, you want to heat it up, it's instant. It's within 30 seconds, it's yeah. to temperature. And here we've got a pot. Now, we're just gonna do some boiling water here. Uh, look at the, look at the, how it boils inside. I bet you don't have a pan at home on a burner that boils up like this No, that exactly. Quickly, right? And again, because it's not, because of that special non-stick surface, look at this, I can put a full package, a full package of pasta in here, okay? Full pound, we'll put the lid back on. And just to show you how quick this heats back up again, just watch. I mean, you can see right through the lid, how fast after it cools how fast it comes back to temperature and that's the electronic underneath okay that's what does it it creates yeah. that heat that gives you that instant control i like having it because you have an extra burner in the house whenever you need yeah. it, especially around holiday season when you're like i uh, wish i had an how extra how many places burner. on your stove do you have do you have four do you have five yeah. maybe six or maybe one of them's a warmer okay right there's only so many places you can cook on it now with this it gives you that extra space and again it's all done with one it's, pot it's it's amazing. All right, if you want it today, it's only $16 on FlexPay. Jared, they're doing free shipping Look on this, this item as well. I'm talking to my producer because I, I didn't even notice that initially in our, when we were doing our show. And you can do so That's much. What I love about like this is it does, off the it, bone it's like having pork. six or seven different types of pans in one. It, exactly, yeah. exactly. It's a wok, it's a fryer, it's a, it's a, a, it's a roaster. stir fries, it's yeah. a roaster, it's a warmer. It literally, you can do all kinds of things with this because of the versatility and because of the controls. I mean, look, t just take a look at this. I mean, here's a, a, a full pork shoulder that yeah. literally falls apart, okay? And we don't have any buns out here in the front, but no, I tell you, you know what? what, you just place that out there. Yes, we do. I mean, Andreas oh, to oh, the rescue. This. Oh, we got bun. Look. <laughs> well, you know what we'll do here? We'll just yeah. do that. We'll put a couple out. Absolutely. I know we have a lot to do. For pulled pork sandwiches, we'll... I mean, look at this. Th that you. is fall off the bone goodness right there. <laughs> and it's all done, again, in the same pot that we're boiling up our, our, our uh, pasta for our spaghetti. It's done in the same pot that we're doing a stir fry in. We're also making a chili. Where if we've done this pork shoulder, comes out perfect, okay? I mean, look, look at that pork. Just look at how tender. Juicy that oh is. Oh my gosh, that is so good. <laughs> and the flavor. Right. So, yeah. so let's move, like I've said, I don't want to run out of yeah. time, but I want to tell everybody about uh, about the other different things. It is the most incredible deep fat fryer you'll ever yep. see in your life. And here's the thing too. And it's normally, not on the stove top. Normally when you buy a fryer, yeah. it does one thing. Yeah, I know. <laughs> this is a pan that also fries. Right. Okay, go ahead, John. No, I, I mean, thing. whether it be chicken, whether it be shrimp, it could be uh, it, any any type of uh, oh, food that you want to fry. Look with it. With the one pot, look at this. I mean, with the electric one pot, you can do literally every type of cooking that you would ever want to do. And again, the cleanup is the best part because you never have to worry about things sticking. You never have to, it's like it just wipes out with a cloth. <laughs> Look at that. I mean, here's, how many chicken legs do we have in we here? We did a lot. I mean, the capacity on it is amazing. And most people, if you're gonna have an indoor fryer, okay, a lot of people go outdoors to do their frying. You don't have to worry about it because again, your controls are instant right here on the back of the, of the unit. It comes with the cord that you plug in. It's, well, we've all got a skillet, those electric skillets. We all know how great those are for breakfast. Now you've got an electric one pot that does literally, it's as virtual, it's as, it's as, uh, as, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> It's universal yes. as a skillet. And I love, let's put the lid on there too so we can make sure, because you know now, chicken has moisture. I've got in, this so. one, just to show you again the nonstick, I've got this cranked up to 375, all right? And I'm gonna take some sugar and we're gonna pour it in the bottom of this to caramelize this sugar. In mm -hmm. fact, we're gonna burn some of this sugar on the bottom of this pan to show you how nonstick the rock surface really is. Again, remember, it's metal utensil safe, okay? You don't have to worry about what type of utensils to use in here. You, we've all had those pans or those the cookware that has the, the, the nonstick spray yeah. on surface, right? It'll never ch crack, chip, or peel. Guaranteed for 10 years, okay? This is one of those pots that you'll probably pass down. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so amazing. And, and, and again, I'm gonna crank this all the way we're up. Burn it. And we'll we're show gonna you burn how it easy. on there. But while that's burning, let's move down. Oh, and see look what at we're this. Doing. Our pasta is almost done. In fact, yeah. it is done. Look at that. If you like it al dente, yeah. That's, look at this. I mean, comes out perfect. And again, that was done in almost no time at all. Exactly. Yeah. Almost it's no so time quick at all. It's so easy. And you know what I love too is it's all in one. Yes. If you wanted to strain it, then put it back in. You could add your sauce. You could put your meatballs, and then you could turn it down, and people could serve themselves. It's a warmer in addition. All right, we just got extremely busy. 
This is free shipping. It's $16.65. This is the cookware that I own, which is Starfrit. Uh, I like it because I don't have to worry about any, any sticking. I, I, I cook omelets. I cook eggs in here. I cook pretty much everything. Danny used it last night to make himself hot dogs at 10 o'clock at night. I'm like, what do you cook? And he's like, I'm hungry. And he was using <laughs> hot dogs. And it, 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 which I love doing dogs and burgers in a fry pan. I just think they come out so great. But look at the capacity here. If you need to make chili for a whole bunch of people, yep. you can do it all in this pot. And you can brown the meat. Yes. You can do the we onions. We brown the meat. Yep. We put the onions in. Now we're putting the sauce in. We can add whatever, you know, the, uh, the chili seasoning, okay, as much or as little as you like. But I'll tell you what, for a chili pot, and again, we cooked it, we can serve it right in the same pot. If you wanted to make up a batch of chili and take it to a cookout, now you can take it with you. And again, because of that one pot design, because of the, uh, the, the controller and the speed that this heats up and cool yeah. and, and actually can cool down, right. you can keep it as a warmer on your countertop. Great for holidays. You can use it yeah. as a serving, a serving uh, uh, vessel, okay? And because it plugs in, and I'm, again, I'm gonna unplug this to show you. This is what plugs into the side of the unit. Mm -hmm. You've got your non, the, uh, uh, there's no heat on these handles at all. I've right. got a full Stay pot cool. of chili here, yep. stay cool handles. It's got the four legs underneath that keep it up off the countertop or your tabletop. And literally, as soon as you turn that to the temperature within 30 seconds, it's at that temperature and ready uh, to I've cook. I've never seen one heat up as much and they put, they put a huge heating coil inside so that yep. it gets super hot. Look at this, our I stir mean, when you're stir frying going. and things like that, you want high heat. You need it to get super duper hot in order for you to get the caramelization. Right. And we got that. Now we're doing all this in 12 minutes. Obviously you would take more time uh, to be able to get things perfectly cooked the way you like it. But we wanted to show you the versatility yes. of the machine. And so we're jumping around a little bit, but, but you got to understand this thing is a lifesaver. If you are a working mom, if you're retired and you live with your wife or your husband and you, you don't want to have seven different pans every time you want to cook something. If you love to make soups or stews or chilies, if you like to do... Uh, you know, uh, uh, steam lobster. That's if right. You, like you can do, do lobster seafood, in here. Mussels. Hey, clams. Oh my you know, gosh. You, you can do your clams in here, mussels. And again, the non-stick. And let's go back over to the end over here. Okay. Because the non-stick here. You, John. Yeah. Hey, I don't. I appreciate Chicken's it. Chicken's looking good. The chicken's almost done. Yeah. But I want you to see this right here. Now I'm going to turn this down, okay? And I don't know if we can get a shot inside this pot. Get this out of the way for you. That sugar that we yes. poured in there burned to the bottom, but I want you to see something. When I tip this pot, you'll literally see. Now, you don't have to worry about anything sticking to this surface, okay? With a cloth, you can clean it perfectly without having to worry about anything sticking to that surface. I mean, that's the yeah. technology. And again, it's that special non-stick technology and, with the beads that we create the air pockets inside there. And then the coating goes over the top of that. That's what creates that non-stick that virtually nothing will that, stick to this and the, makes it so easy to clean up. That is an incredibly impressive demo and because because look at it just best of all it's, it's metal actually dry. utensil safe. It's the way that it's manufactured the aluminum extra conduct conductivity and then remember they they blast this with little steel pebbles That's right. to create the non-stick surface. It's on flex pay never a better opportunity to pick it up and it's free shipping and handling. Chicken's almost there. It's almost John. there. Yeah, it's almost it needs there. a little bit longer. Yep. But you'll have 20 minutes to cook it at home. We don't have that here, unfortunately. But I promise you, that chicken is going to come out golden brown, and you will love it. John Florell, great Thank job. You I know so it's, much. A, it's a lot to juggle with all these different bots, <laughs> but you did a great job. Uh, and if you'd like it, six three three one eight eight. John will be back again eventually because John's here all the time. He's like all of us. We're all here. Uh, hey, if you want to, hey, you want to get that for twenty nine dollars. What a deal. Let's take $20 off if you get a brand new credit card uh, and uh, get it for $29.95. It's a great deal. All you need to do is apply for the HSN credit card. When you're approved, you're going to get $20 put in your account. You can use it on anything you want. Uh, and we give you uh, things like extra flex and all kinds of great deals. So make sure you check it out. Heck, you might even want to use it on our Smeg Stand Mixer. So let me tell you a story about this amazing company. First of all, award-winning company, top of the line products across the board. Uh, this is one of the most beautiful machines I've ever seen. I have worked in the restaurant business. I worked in the restaurant business for about 19, 20 years, okay? I've never seen anything like this. Now, yeah. I've seen, I, I shouldn't say, I've seen machines that do similar things to this. There's a very, very, very good machine out there that does this. First of all, it's more expensive. This has almost twice the power. Yeah. And in my opinion, this 
kicks its butt. This is the most beautiful <laughs> yes. machine. Uh, it's a, and Carrie Maletta was here, everybody. Hi, Carrie Good Maletta. Morning. And she will talk about the company uh, that, that produces this for you. But I will tell you, as a restaurant tour, as a person that worked in the business a long time, I've never seen anything so beautiful. The power is unbelievable. The quality is number one. And what they did for us today, because we, we want you to get these home and I want you to try them. It is, it's got this retro beautiful design and color. Um, but I want you to get it home. If you can get it home for, for uh, what's it, 53? Is that what it says on FlexPay? It is $140 off today. So it's already down to nothing. This will be one of the best investments you've ever make. If you love to cook or bake or do any of those things, you'll love this machine. Top of the line construction uh, of aluminum, zinc, and steel put together. 10 yep. variable speeds, a five quart mixing bowl. It has what they call direct drive power. And we'll explain why that is important for any machine that's gonna be a heavy duty machine. It is restaurant chef quality. Absolutely. If that matters to you, then you need to grab this. Hi, Carrie. Hi, good, good morning. Good I'm morning, like, good girl. afternoon. I'm like, I've been up for so long. It's I, <laughs> I know. Anyway. This, um, this does pretty much everything. This does everything. This is yeah. your workhorse in the kitchen, but this is also, we, we in Smeg, we say we're technology with design yes. and with, with style. And what that means is that not only is it something gorgeous and aesthetically beautiful, but it's also giving you all the power that you need in the kitchen to do everything from easy jobs to harder jobs. But when it comes to baking, you really have to have something that's going to power through all of the jobs from doing cakes and cookies all the way up to maybe doing meats and shredded chicken and things like that. Because again, this is that aluminum die cast body uh, that you have at the top, but then you also have 600 watts of power and with a direct drive motor. And what yeah. that means is it's gonna give you that very even torque that you need to power through big jobs. It's gonna give you a five quart stainless steel mixer. Notice that our mixing bowl is lower and wider and I have added three cake mixes to this. Wow. Three. So you're doing so three cakes. Three cakes at yeah. one time. So talk about saving time. That's something that we really want to do in the kitchen. Now, I'm going to take this down because what I want you to see now, how often are you going to do three cake mixes? Probably not. But I wanted to make sure that you could see the capacity level That's of you. what five quarts offers you. So I'm just going to take off my attachment. I was using my paddle attachment. You are getting three attachments with this. So they're coming with. That's going to be your paddle. It's going to be your whisk and it's going to be your dough hook. Now, when I come over here, what is super important now, number one, that's your capacity. But number two, no lumps and bumps, completely perfectly blended. Yeah. That's what you need and what you want when you're working quickly in the kitchen and you need to move through all of your baking. Thank you so mm -hmm. much. So again, three boxes. Think about how many cookies you can do, how many cakes you can do. Easter's around the corner. It's spring. We're starting to Ugh. bake. We're starting to come out with some really nice things. Well, Think about if you had this in your kitchen to get through those hard jobs. And, and uh, you know, all that power. And look at, if you come in on the, uh, this is the uh, mint. Um, and I want you to look at how beautiful this machine is. It, I mean, it really is gorgeous. Um, it's got that beautiful retro design. I, I love, it almost, it's so smooth and, and, and a kind of a buff finish on the outside. It really is, um, yeah. I mean, it's really, really gorgeous. Um, uh, other attachments obviously are available for this as well. In addition, we, you know, we're, we're giving you all this great stuff. We're giving you the mixer and the bowl. You get the whisk attachment, the beater attachment, the dough hook attachment yep. is included um, with this. And um, the your choice of shield. colors, which is mint. I have it in. I like this. This cream is amazing. That's what I have. In my kitchen, I have this, all to make appliances, and they are all cream. This is the cream color. Uh, this, I guess we're just calling blue. It comes in black, and then it comes in silver, which is the first one that we showed you. Listen how quiet it is. That is what's really wonderful about us. We're well known for being one of the quietest on the marketplace. We're also well known, remember I was talking about 600 watts. Any other five quart mixer out in the marketplace right now is only up to about 350. So that is a huge difference with us compared to everyone else. So what I love here is that we are working very easily on our meringue. It is taking meringue and making it a simple, simple job. Please notice that as this is spinning, it has planetary motion. Planetary motion is something you absolutely want to have in your stand mixer because it means the head is moving in one direction right. the attachment is moving in another and what that means is less time spent stopping and taking a spatula Mixing, to yeah. move all of you know everything around so you have 10 speeds on the top here so I'm actually going to show you that so the 10 speeds range from a 1 to a 10 
the top, it'll also show you which um, attachments you should be using. So only one to four for your dough hook. You never want to go super fast using dough. You want to go nice and Take slow, time, like that yeah. kneading process. And then you can use your paddle or your whisk in a variable motion. It has a smooth start function, which is also very important. Because if you're using smooth start, if you, if you don't have smooth start and you have like a flower in there, what happens is you start it, yeah. you've had this you're potentially gonna, happen without start it. start snowing in there. Boom! Boom, it flies out. So smooth start yeah. means it starts slowly and ramps up to that speed that you need. Now, I'm gonna let this work for just a minute because the big thing about meringue is we wanna have that perfect peak. Right. So we're waiting for a harder peak yeah. on this, so I'm gonna come back. I love the simplicity and design um, with Smeg. Yeah. We have taken away all of the things because somehow along the way we thought that we need timers and gadgets and buttons and all these things. But the thing about a stand mixer, when you're working with a stand mixer, is you need to keep eyes on what you're doing. You're looking for perfect consistency. You're looking in different timing on different things. So here I'm gonna work on my whipped cream, which is gonna turn into a raspberry mousse. That I wanna do at a higher speed because whipped cream, of course, we're trying to whip. If you've ever tried to do this with just your hands or with maybe a, a mixer, a hand mixer, it's, it's definitely take, it takes a lot longer and it's a lot harder to accomplish. With a stand mixer that's going to give you all that power, you just stand back, maybe you're pre-prepping something else, maybe you're working on something else, you don't have to babysit it, it's going to do the job for you. So just in a moment, we'll have our whipped cream. But something I wanna point out that we were just talking about, they are beautiful. And the thing about us is, we are, this is an award-winning stand mixer. It's won multiple architectural and design awards. Gorgeous. I want you to think for a minute about how much time and money we put into our living rooms, finding furniture and finding art. But where does everyone end up in your house? Do they end up in the kitchen when they visit? Because at my house, we always end up in the kitchen. Yeah. And two things. One, if everyone's gonna be in the kitchen, why not have that piece on your counter that you can feel proud about? That people are going to notice and say, wow, what is that? What do you have there? And they'll be drawn to it. But also, if you're looking for a refresh in your kitchen, forget about spending thousands of dollars on new cabinets and new things like that. Get your Smeg stand mixer, and I guarantee you, people will notice, and it'll definitely give you that nice, bright feel in your kitchen, because these colors are so fun. You know what I love? We have two machines on at the same time, and neither one of us are raising our voice. Right. We are just talking, and we are right in front. This my microphone is right in front of the machine, and you can see, now we just turned one off. Now, you want to talk about the perfect meringue. Yeah, good Whoa. job, girl. Oh, yeah. That is That's what, what it's we're looking for. Look let's like. get. Let's see my good peak. I could probably go another, another minute or two. Another or minute that. or two, but you're I very really close. Could. You're, yeah. you're kind of at marshmallow stage, but I you're am. almost there. So if you take these, you can actually bake these and make the most delectable treats with a meringue. Of course, we know a meringue from using it on a meringue pie. But, um, you know, that's the thing. You want to keep an eye on it because now if you want a soft peak for your pie, you're ready. But I want to go just a moment longer. Here we are. There we go. If you bake these, they're so delicious and they're very low calorie because all this is is an egg wash. <laughs> it's an egg white. So yeah, and just a little sugar. I mean, but that's it. That's all you're using. So, you know, calories stay yummy. lower on that. Put some right? cocoa powder in here, make totally. chocolate one. But now we put vanilla in ours. We did a yummy vanilla. So I'm gonna give that just an extra moment. Oh my god. Okay, my whip mm. is done over here, you guys. So I'm gonna actually just add in really quick my raspberry syrup. So this is a very easy way to make a raspberry mousse. Okay, so the mousse, you'll just take it to the next level. If I wanted to stop there and just have my what whipped cream. You, you almost, you're getting ready to make butter. Oh my gosh, I know, I just <laughs> let that go. Again, the power on this, you really are gonna be so impressed. And if you look at the reviews, that's, that's what people are saying. Number one, it's so beautiful that they love it. And number two, that it is just knocking them out about how much power every, this has. Every review is five stars. All perfect. Yep. I mean, that's saying a lot. Yeah, Everybody really was is. like, and let me, know, let me I, I tell you, you know, I know you have access to some of the better, uh, you know, the, the, we all know that there's a big brand now, a great brand, don't get me wrong. What I'm saying is, if you want something that is completely different in its design as far as how beautiful it is, I would say simplistic. That's but, the thing. But so sophisticated. But still all 
the technology that you need. That's what, again, what we pride ourselves on is giving you something that's going to get the job done. We're not, you're not missing anything. We're just making it easy to use. And I think that in America, we appreciate that. Mm -hmm. But this is completely made in Italy, a third generation Italian family. Um, this started in 1948. We started with enamels, moved into appliances like stoves. You may know us from our refrigerators, right. but now we are actually, now I think this one's perfect, and now moved into small appliances. We're one of the leading manu small appliance manufacturers um, existing right now. There, there it is. There you go, Carrie Millet. There it is. Look at that peak. Perfect peak. It's waving at us. Oh okay. <laughs> Well, and, and let me tell you, you try okay. to do that by hand, you're going to be here for the rest of the day. Exactly. I think your strawberry mousse is probably finished. And also what's really cool is if you're working really fast in the kitchen like I just was, it actually has a automatic uh, safety shutoff. So if I were moving really quick and I forgot to turn, uh, to take the, uh, the knob down, it would actually turn off for me automatically. So I really love that. Uh, it's $140 off today and it's on free shipping. So I encourage you, there are six flex pays on here. If you want to get it even cheaper... I have a way for you to do that with an HSN credit card. If you if you buy an if you get an HSN credit card brand new today and you apply and you approve, which they do very quickly, they'll take another $20 off making this $299. That's unheard of. This is top of the line Italian made appliance. That company has been known for years and years and years for their wonderful work and their construction of their machines and, and how beautifully they're designed. Let me just tell you this, if somebody comes into your kitchen and you have this in there and they know anything about cooking, they're mm -hmm. gonna be very impressed. Definitely. Because I, I have, there's another very, very good Italian company called DeLonghi, which I love. I have a lot of their appliances mm -hmm. too. Um, and everybody knows that they are upscale, they're a little more expensive, but they are worth it. This, in this case, you are getting it so we can get them out there because we want more word of mouth on Smeg. Um, they're already getting all perfect five-star reviews. You need to try this. If you are a baker, you know what I'm talking about. If you're an aspiring chef or cook, you know what I'm talking about with this company. But if you want great results, and I want you to listen to the direct drive. There's practically nothing to listen to. Direct drive basically is gear to gear uh, implementation inside, which makes it so smooth, so, so smooth. quiet. It runs cooler. It's, it's more reliable. Yep. Everything, every, all of the above, it's, you know, and, it, and it's more expensive to do this process. Absolutely, which is why most companies do not have that type of motor. So with this, when you're working through these really tough, really heavy things like bread, this is kneading bread with ease. Notice it's not flying around. And the reason for that is because it has anti-slip feet at the bottom. And then also it's giving you that perfectly kneaded bread so we don't have to do the work. I, if you got to the point now or mm -hmm. kneading is a difficult thing for you. Right. And not to mention, if you're kneading bread, you have to sit there and continue to go and go and, and go. go. It's tiring. So let the machine do it for you. Um, it has an easy release button here back here to move your head down so the motor head comes straight down just uh -huh. like this. Again, if you forget to turn this off, it will automatically turn itself off when you press the button and release. Now, what I'm making here, this is super fun, is my beet burgers. So I have my chickpeas in here. I have my onions in here. I'm going to pop in my key. Um, don't forget also we do have our pouring shield. I keep them off during presentations because um, for me it kind of it, it does it impedes your view. But the shoot on ours is completely different than others in that it has a nice lead on it. Yeah. Most have just a hole here. And so what happens, it kind of defeats Flower the purpose. Goes everywhere. You're so, exactly. Having the lead on the shoot really makes it super simple with your pouring Another shield. Another design feature that is improved from the traditional mixers out there. Yep. They really, really thought about it when they put this together. And then, you know, they would what they did is they talked to chefs and they yeah. said chefs what are you looking for and the end result was this this machine came out and I will tell you it's amazing whether you're making your own granolas whether you're making your own batters yep. cakes pies doughs whatever it is maybe you're making your own dips or sauces I am telling you Smeg is the way to go try this out it's only $53 on your credit card get it home you can use it for 30 days it doesn't work for you I know this, It'll, you'll name it. You'll be your little pet. You'll what? never want, you'll, you'll love it. It becomes your yeah. favorite thing in the kitchen and it's I, so the beautiful. number one thing everyone will recognize hey, Carrie, as soon as they get in. We're, we're running out of time. I want it, are you gonna do oh, yes. meat? I, 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 I'm dying to see this okay, thing so, do ground beef. Okay, so it's really awesome. So here, oh we're just gonna gosh. pop it. It makes ease. If you've never had freshly ground meat before, oh you, this is an attachment my you My mother can had get. a hand crank one. Oh, <laughs> my, forget Bless that. Bless her heart. Look how easy this is. I'm just pressing it down. Take oh. Make it super duper fresh, and that's one of the attachments. We have many pasta attachments. We have our meat grinder attachment. We have our grater attachments. This makes 
minced meat of it the job. It does make minced meat of the competition. <laughs> Look. And there is nothing like fresh ground meat, you guys. This is, you know, the preservatives and everything they use in the store. Forget look about it. Look at it now. I want okay. you to look. Look at that. Now, does, when you go to the butcher, look at that beautiful ground beef. Oh, my gosh. I want to make a burger right now. <laughs> Gary Maletta, wonderful Thank job. You so much. You're amazing. Thank Customer you. Appreciation Month all month long. And I'm heading out for our uh, today's special. Stick around. With so many places to shop, we wanted to say that your loyalty doesn't go unnoticed. So, to celebrate Customer Appreciation Month, we're making the entire month of April all about you. We're giving away $1,000 a day to your favorite charities. So many extras for HSN credit card holders. And one lucky winner will win $25,000. It could be you. From all of us, we'd like to say... The Patricia Nash brand is all about old world craftsmanship and amazing quality. We started with handbags and accessories. Now we make amazing scarves and hand weaved shoes. It's taking all of that old world craftsmanship and memories of our heritage or travels abroad, bringing it all for today's woman. The thing I love most about shopping at HSN. Do I have to pick just one? I'd have to say FlexPay. Mm -hmm. It allows me to get the things I want now and make monthly payments without any interest or fees. I got a new mattress for the guest bedroom, a fabulous cookware set for my sister's wedding, and a little something just for me. FlexPay gives me the flexibility to buy what I need now without the stress of having to pay for it all at once. And no interest. Beat that layaway. We use goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing